Oh, it's the last minute essentials. Brecky. Also a uh, toothbrush. Forgot about that. So um, I recommend doing that. Obviously, again, I forget. I forget everything, you know? Sandals. You need sandals attached to your frame. Obviously. Retain your flip-flops. Very important. job <laughs> so like why 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 not just go ride my bike bike get some chips sleep in the field ride home in the morning there's literally no reason why i can't do that so uh that's what i'm gonna do and it's what i'm doing right now look at this just countryside get this i haven't actually been to the island where i'm I'm going uh, since I was in year seven at school. So I don't know, we camped there, so let's go camping there again. I haven't actually stopped uh, since I started. So uh, I actually don't know if I'm going the right way. I went through the town that I knew I had to go through. Yeah, so probably, you could probably grab all this. I don't know across tires. You don't really need a gravel bike. So uh, probably maybe put some gravel tires on. So yeah, almost there. I'm hoping I see a sign that says Mersey soon. Uh, and I'll see you when I get to Mersey. This is a bridge. This is my bike. We made it onto Mersey. So uh, now it's time to find some chips. And uh, if I have daylight, should easily find a place to sleep. Yeah. I thought it would 
always be less hilly though. Why is there a hill on an island in a marsh? <sighs> the best tube shop in Essex. It's closed at five. Why? Didn't they know I was coming? I was coming for the best chips in Essex. I am disappointed. But I'll find some more. chips to my bag with my phone cable now all I know is that you can ride you can walk all the way around Mersey there's like a path and I know that at the east side of Mersey there are some uh, bushes and a cliff and a beach so uh, I'm gonna ride along the coast path until I get there I can eat my chips. It's just easy. It's nice easy. Made it, guys. Now, I'm gonna go that way. Gravel mode. Activated. Sand. Treacherous. Dead stop. Inevitable. But look at this off-road section for the night. Uh, I'm in a field. Yeah, the sea is there. I just gotta follow this, the edge of the sea all the way around and more treacherous sand. Oh, the treacherous sand. Uh, I just gotta follow that. Gravel in. Uh, gravel. Nice and bumpy. It's a nice change from boring old tarmac. Used to riding. Man. It seems like this is a path most unfrequented. I think I'm going to actually have to stop because it's uh, completely caved away. Nice. Dodgy cliff. We have um, ghosts in the field. Thank you. Path. There. Road again. Can't wait to get on the road again. You probably can't see me now. I don't know. How the light is on this camera. So, uh, oh shit, more treacherous sand. Okay, so fine. If you can't see me, you went your morning, you're gonna see some things. Because uh, you won't be able to see my camp when I set it up. Damn. Through the sand, turns out the coast path is partially closed, which is a good sign for me, but walking across the sand, not good. So it's not gravel anymore. It's, it's just sunk across. I don't know. Whew. Made it. Long because we've got a lake full of bikey boys and a path that is non-existent. So made when you see the coast path is closed. Uh, probably don't take it. You might have to go. Oh God, that's gonna be sludgy. <laughs> On Sludge Central in the dark because uh, you can't actually go across because uh, the sea is going across. I got myself into this mess. It's my fault. I forded the river now. It was uncomfortable. I'm kind of wet. So when I get back, I'm just gonna have to dry out I think <laughs> oh you're an idiot it's uh, very dark and uh, I don't know what time it is probably about 8ish so what we're gonna do we're actually gonna cut around on the road because it turns out the entire coast path doesn't it so I'm gonna cut around on the road get into the country park and uh, go to sleep we well, you know it's all good now. Here we are. It says like security. <laughs> I 
something. See where I am. Uh, so I'll keep this short and snappy, you know. Uh, I'm going to set up camp and uh, remembering the rules of uh, being a good camper because it's technically not legal, I think. So the idea is that you leave no trace that you were there and uh, yeah, leave no trace. Don't go having a party, dropping some rubbish everywhere. Just going to pack up a nice little place to sleep and yeah, see you in the morning. Bye -bye. Just get my stuff out, those spare socks are definitely going to be needed. Just going to set up the tarp from this bush over my bike, onto the floor around here. Sleeping bag, bivvy. We've got a pretty private, the main walking path just over there. Uh, you got like, this cliff here, which is quite nice. And uh, you got the sea. There's a really light breeze, so yeah, we're just going to keep it chill. No leaving no trace and all that, you know, you know how it is. Let's do it. Good, right? Good morning. Good morning, everybody. <laughs> it is uh, 6 a.m. And uh, that was a crazy sleep. Uh, got my top, came up in the night. Um, something got moist. It got moist last night, apparently. Rained. Uh, it went to rain. That's okay. I was listening to a in top town. So, uh, I'm gonna get packed up, eat brekkie, and let's go. Time for today eat delicious ramp and um, go home but I'm not going to go home all the way on the road because that's boring. I'm going to head to Malden and I'm going to follow the canal path to sort of like Chelmsford, Paper Mill Lock and then I'm going to ride down through the roads from there but it's all going to be canal path. Hopefully there'll be a cafe open. Hopefully I can have some coffee. My spot was stealthy. Am I right? Am I right? Can't even I'm in these bushes. You can't see me. But the only the only issue I'd say there is is uh, this cliff. You don't want to go forward than that. The issue is that my shoes are obviously very wet. I can't walk outside this patch of dry grass because my sandals disappeared sometime last night. So uh, let's go see those today. The Dan. You know what though? I should have just slept down there on the beach. That'd be luxurious, wouldn't it? So that is a form of my little sun trap, but we're on our way. Plan for today, get some water, see if the cafe's open, do some coffee, before we do a poo, then uh, follow the canal back to the place from the lock. Maybe get a coffee there. Just leisure, you know. Pleasure and pleasure. Oh, oh bike packing trip wouldn't be cool unless you follow that, yeah, the canal. So that's the plan. Follow the canal, paper lock, back through Danbury, back home. Easy peasy.
Hobridge Basin. This is the canal and that goes all the way to Chelmsford. So I'm going to follow that and I think that's the joy of having a versatile, slightly knobbly tired bike like mine. Uh, beautiful though, beautiful. So let's get done with this canal. Here we go. Uh, this also says England Coast Park, so uh, should I just like carry on going? Should I just go the entire way around the English coast? Hmm, hmm, good idea, good idea. Bye everyone, you'll never see me again. I've just moved into my new home. Oh my god, just got the keys. Oh. Love the canal. First chillity is uh, is the balls. Oh. Bumpy, bumpy puffs. I'm fine. I'm fine. So that's where I was. Um, I'm here now. I'm going to ride all the way to there because there's a cafe there. And you know what cafe means? Coffee. And from coffee, I go that way, then I'm home. So, let's get on the fucking rig. The lock. Now, it's just miles of empty canal path. Bumpy canal path. Yeah. This one's real cool. Woo! Some people, they're picking blackberries. It's autumn now. That's what I'm doing. And these are tasty boys. Homeal <laughs> luck. And uh, apparently it's called Homeal luck. Because. Uh, there used to be a mill here, not because Yo Mama used to live here. This is cool. So like, despite actually not being that far, from civilization or anything like obviously there's a farm there horses and stuff but it actually feels quite far away from a lot of stuff and that's rare in this area and uh makes you really happy Mersey was nice enough I think that's where I have to go right I should just come somewhere like this just camp over there no one's gonna see me Right by the river. Woo! Look at that luxury life. This is very bumpy by the way. Maybe that's a reason not. But it's just view. Started with the hills. Man. Now I'm in Danbury. I wish I had my mountain bike. So I can strap some bombs. But 
doing that hill just then reminded me that when I get home, literally like 5k before I get home is a massive climb, Hamburg Hill it's called. It's not long, it's just pointy as fuck. <sighs> it's gonna be, it's just gonna be a killer. Lines. himself 
as well this entire trip all right let's just get past this video back to that point good for you you're as much of a loser as i am we all lose here maybe i could start putting all my start making videos you know be big success big youtube guy every uh video capital letters i went for a big bike ride i guess you won't believe this happened <laughs> so anyway uh, thank you for uh, sticking with me all this time i'm gonna go home now holy cry uh maybe drink some coffee probably cry some more uh, and so you're going back in my mouth bye